Well, it's a cold night in the forecast. Many of us are already dreaming of days filled with snow. I know for the kids, it's all about the snow day that they're looking forward yeah, to. Yeah, hopefully they'll still get some snow days with virtual school learning these days. Well, anyway, early fall, every fall, we asked the Fox 8 weather team for their winter weather predictions. Emily Bird gave us her outlook this morning. Now we turn to meteorologist Charles Ewing for his prediction. So how much snow are we talking about, Charles? Oh, yeah, that is the big question a lot of us always ask. Hey, how much snow are we going to get? How will the winter shape up? Well, for now, anyway, I'm thinking this dry weather pattern will continue so far for the month of November. We're like two inches behind. So I think this dry pattern will continue with the dry conditions. I think there's a chance we could overall have a warmer winter. Sure, at times we will have some cold spells, but I think once you add everything up, we will average on the warmer side this upcoming winter. Our first snow will probably happen around January the 6th. Now, I'm not counting the flurries or dusting we might have in December. I'm thinking the real snow, you can pull out a measuring stick and measure. I think that will happen on January the 6th. And how much snow could we see? Well, I'm thinking around four inches of snowfall will be possible. That's a little bit below normal in keeping with the dry weather trends that might continue into the winter season. Our largest snowfall will probably be roughly around three inches. And then check this out, folks. How cold will it be this winter? I'm thinking around 14 degrees. Van's over there laughing at me. You'll see his prediction later on in the 5 o'clock news. By that laughter, you can probably guess he's probably going colder than 14. But hey, guys, I'm going 14 degrees. That would be the coldest temperature we will see during the upcoming winter. So, guys, I hope you like this winter weather outlook because it contains some snow, some cold temperatures, but nothing really to lock us <laughs> at home for days and days and days. Charles, I'm not looking forward to 14 degrees. I'm hoping that's on my off day. <laughs> so I go. can stay yeah. inside. Yeah. I know it's going to be cold, but no snow tonight. No, we're not talking about any snow tonight, but it would be awfully chilly as we head into our overnight time period.